Hi, I'm Pastor Mark. Today I'd like you to picture your mind as a garden. A garden that is meant to produce the fruit of truth and wisdom. The garden of your mind is meant to engage the truth of God. And that truth is found in His Word. And when you find it, you'll not only be tending to the garden of your mind, but also soothing the turmoil of your heart. That's exactly what the Apostle Paul does as he writes his letters to the churches. He fights the upset and unsettled emotions in their hearts by teaching their minds biblical truth. And that's what we must do. Heal our emotions by the truth of the Word of God. So, do you feel lonely? Joshua 1.5 As I was with Moses, so I will be with you. I will never leave you nor forsake you. Do you feel overwhelmed? Matthew 11.28 Come to me, all you who are weary and burdened, and I will give you rest. Are you worried about tomorrow? Jeremiah 29.11 I know the plans I have for you, declares the Lord, plans to prosper you and not to harm you, plans to give you hope and a future. Are you afraid to face death? John 14.2 In my Father's house are many rooms. If it were not so, I would have told you. I am going there to prepare a place for you. Calm the emotion of your heart with Scripture truth that penetrates your mind. 2 Thessalonians 2.15 says, So then, brothers, stand firm and hold to the teachings we passed on to you, whether by word of mouth or by letter. Paul says, hold on to the teaching I gave you. For us it means, hold on to what the Word of God teaches. Be sure that what you trust in is in line with the apostolic teaching. Stay true and refuse to retool or revise or rewrite the faith to conform to modern fads. Hold on to truth. Hold on to hope. Protect your heart with a mind centered on the Word of God. And may God bless you. And I hope to see you this Sunday.